Welcome back to Meet Your Neighbor. We are here in Hopkinton at the home of Cynthia Franza. Cynthia came to Hopkinton just two years ago from Brazil, and I'm looking forward to entering today and meeting with Cynthia to talk a little bit about her life in both places. Welcome to my home! <laughs> <laughs> Hello. This is an... Ah, Brazilian things, come on in. Welcome. That <laughs> yeah. Hello, Cynthia. Thank you for having me in your beautiful home here in Hopkinton this morning. Hi, thank you. <laughs> well, welcome. Um, it, it's uh, a delight to be here. It's springtime and uh, there are beautiful surroundings here. But I think maybe to go back a little bit, uh, you have not been in Hopkinton all that long, uh, although it feels that way, and coming into your home. Um, can you tell a little bit about how you came to the town of Hopkinton? Okay, of course. <laughs> it's a good story. <laughs> And we, I moved to this place, to Hockington, in January last year, mm -hmm. uh, January 8th. It's my first time in one, one home, big home. Uh, when I lived in Brazil, I lived in an apartment. Mm -hmm. and I didn't cook nothing when I lived in Brazil. Ridiculous, okay, because I'm 40 years old <laughs> last year, don't, don't cook nothing, oh my god. <laughs> and when I moved here, uh, it's winter, it was winter. Mm -hmm. It's um, right, cold. So not this winter, the previous one. Uh, this back in, uh, 2013, mm -hmm. yeah, it's yeah. Uh, cold for, yeah. for us Brazilians. A lot and of snow, I think. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> snowstorm. Uh -huh. It's a good and different experience. To and us. you left the weather of Brazil at that time that was. 70s, uh -huh. 100 mm -hmm. Fahrenheit. Uh -huh. and Quite a shock. Totally. <laughs> The clothes need to change the clothes, need to change a lot of things and use the, the stove, stove thing in the open the snow in your car. The, the snow in your car. Yeah, uh -oh. yeah. Yes, a lot of things that need yeah. to learn to mm -hmm. take off the snow of the, the oh, yeah. garden, uh -huh. other things. Yeah. And when you move it, uh, I cannot see any body on the street when you first moved in the winter yeah in the winter in this I, neighborhood with yeah i houses. love this neighborhood but yeah, yeah. Okay. And, uh, what is the people <laughs> <laughs> what's the people here and uh, in cold i think it's 20 degrees fahrenheit for me mm. it's very cold and one day it's, it's my experience marvelous experience here one day in january the end of the january last year one woman uh, ring the bell in my home and okay I talk with my hands okay <laughs> all the time and ding, ring the bell and comes in the no one on the streets very cold I cannot see any anybody and hello welcome to the neighborhood and I oh my god <laughs> I forgot, yeah, 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 it's for me, it's amazing. Mm -hmm. And uh, I forgot uh, that I live in Massachusetts, mm -hmm. not in Brazil. Mm -hmm. And I gave her a big, warm Brazilian hug. <laughs> <laughs> nice to meet you. And my neighbor, oh my God, because it's different here. It's a, and, uh, and it's, uh, I'm not so oh my much. God. And my family around me, my, my husband and my stepsons and my son, looking for me, Cynthia, you are crazy. <laughs> you are in Massachusetts. You are not in Brazil. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and I, oh my God. And, but now she's my friend. Okay, it's not so much whole thing. She's my friend. But this this thing for me, it's an amazing thing. It's very different. Never happened this in Brazil with me. Never. In Brazil, it's a people different, outgoing. I never do nothing like that. <laughs> And she gave him a, me one beautiful card with mm -hmm. "Welcome to the neighborhood." Wow. Yeah, with the I I have the card now. I, I put in my box with my treasury. I put in my box of uh, memories and something mm -hmm. like that for the future. <laughs> that was very special. Yeah. Uh, beginning orientation to. Yeah, because to yeah, community. because yeah. it's uh, like a last sun inside my house. Oh, oh my God! The winter. Yes. Yes. 
So yeah, he gave me one one gift bag too with uh -huh. the pumpkin king bread. I never this pumpkin bread is amazing. The bread is <laughs> New England I, favorite. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> delicious. <laughs> and the card and the gift bag with mm -hmm. the one winter candle, mm -hmm. candle winter candle, and I love it. Mm -hmm. Well, very yeah. thoughtful of you. Yeah. And uh, I think that has been a tradition um, from the past, um, and it sounds like it continues on in this neighborhood. Yeah. And I know in our neighborhood also, when I arrived here, the same kind of thing, and it's a really nice way um, to get to know your neighbors uh, in a foreign, different place. Yeah, right? it's, it's, she's so amazing because in a few weeks after, Mm -hmm. uh, she invited me f to one party, mm -hmm. welcome coffee, with the ladies of neighborhood. Uh, yeah, wow. it's, it's very different. Mm -hmm. And of course, I'm a woman, you're a woman, yeah. and uh, oh my God, what the clothes are you going wear? <laughs> it's okay, because it's, a, it's a, my first time with the, all the neighborhood. I'm only, only Americans, mm -hmm. I mean, only the Brazilian. Who is the Brazilian here in the neighborhood? <laughs> yeah, I think the people are curious, I, I don't know. I'm curious if I've... I'm the American and one other people come to the, my home or my neighborhood. I'm curious about the people. Mm -hmm. I'm curious yeah. because I'm curious about their life. Mm -hmm. And I went to the, her house. My move, movement don't come to, from Brazil when I, when I, when I went to, the, to her house. And the women are amazing, mm -hmm. fantastic with me and gave me the, the no pumpkin bread this time. It's the muffins. Cupcakes, typical things, American things. Yeah. And talk, we're talking about the family, beauty, life. Mm -hmm. And I discovered the woman in Brazil, the woman of America, woman, it's the same thing. Same thing. It's the same thing. <laughs> it's the same worries. Uh -huh. and, and the end of the meeting, mm -hmm. and something very special. I cry, I confess, I cry, mm -hmm. I cry. Mm -hmm. Big in my home, okay? <laughs> not, not in front of them, uh -huh. <laughs> the, my, my neighbors. Uh, in the end of the meeting, um, each, each one gave me a Brazilian hug. Ah. It's very special. It means a lot to me. Mm. It means a lot to me. And of course, when I come to my home, I cry <laughs> because it's very beautiful to me. Uh -huh. It's a, I like it. I stay in my home. Yeah. This is my home. This neighborhood is my home. Mm. And thanks God that I, I, I choose the one correct house and the correct neighbors, correct mm. people. I don't know. For me, it's amazing. Well, it's it my good like experience here. <laughs> it, uh, it sounds like you have uh, good neighbors around you, yeah. but it also sounds like you uh, bring home wherever you are, in a way. You bring yeah. home your essence. Yeah. And I want to backtrack a little bit, if you can tell me about Cincha in Brazil and what uh, was part of your life back there. You said you lived in an apartment yeah. in Brazil with your family there, yeah. and you were working. Uh, I work a lot, a lot, full time mm -hmm. with marketing communication. I love mm -hmm. advertising and these things. I I have my I did my college in advertising in Brasilia, the capital of Brazil. I was born in Rio, but I live in in Brasilia. Mm -hmm. And I did my college in advertising. I did my master business administration marketing yeah. in 1999. Mm -hmm. And I worked all my life with marketing communication with a pension in a, a pension fund all right. in Brazilia. And, and you're I very, a lot of vision I know you brought to your yeah. job, not just doing marketing work, but from what I've heard. Yeah, I events. write plays to you're the to, to the company. And why why would you write a play for a leadership? Uh, yeah, with the human resources, I did in partnership, mm -hmm. and I did inter uh, plays with the employees and mm -hmm. the yeah. managers, and uh, put all the team. Yeah. Uh, acting. Wow. Yeah. With and how the, did that go over with uh, all the employees? Did they say no, no? Or? No, no, because <laughs> everyone knows me. Uh -huh, yeah. <laughs> oh, she just speaks. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> Thank you. Uh -huh. And it's it's funny because it's different when you go to the in front of the people. Mm -hmm. You are you are like my my you work with me and then the same same time you go to in front of me and act mm -hmm. for explain about leadership or ex teamwork or something mm -hmm. like that the creative way in the other way it's different for people it's i think it's a it's a good learning for people mm -hmm. it's yeah. important way i love that you i love it help them to wake up a little bit in their work in pension yeah work all yeah. that involved with that <laughs> by putting it into theater yeah, i love a creativity different ways for yeah. these things not the same thing the same way not, not this i i love i like the different things for 
for your life, for your job, mm -hmm. for your thing. And but the people who work with me know me, mm -hmm. know how is my way. And hey, teacher's like, ah, teacher, teacher comes, ha ah, because I'm very happy all the time. And it's a, a big smile, it's, uh, it, it's me, it's mm -hmm. me, it's, it's my way of life. <laughs> it's and you got them to run also. Yeah, right yeah. When I moved here, uh, after the winter. <laughs> oh, I mean the uh, people in Brazil in your company. Right? I run. Uh, yeah, the oh, original. Good percentage? Yeah, now I think 80% of the company. 80%. Yeah. You uh, got them all running? All running. Uh, some race or some run wow. because it's, um, it's a good idea for health. Mm -hmm. And uh, the original idea is a First time it's a patronage, patronage sponsor mm -hmm. with yeah. the one race, mm -hmm. and and then uh, human resources pick the the idea, and now it's a big thing. It's an important thing wow. for the company. They wow. put the t-shirts of the uh -huh. company. Go ahead, you run half marathon, marathon, ten ten k, five k. Do they have a team name? And the name of the company is Estelle. This is the oh, same yeah. name of the equipe wow. Estelle. We wish Estelle. them well. Yeah, yeah, Estelle, yeah, their yeah. Next marathon. I'm very proud. Of, <laughs> yeah, I'm a good, rep a good representant, representant uh -huh. of the team oh, here. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. But I, and when I moved here, I need to reconnect to my to my things, mm -hmm. and uh, and I looking for in the newspaper about the clubs or running clubs. In April last year, I I found the Hopkins Running Club. And I joined it mm -hmm. to the, the group. 300 people. It's a lot of people, yeah. a lot of friends. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know, of course, I don't know everyone. Mm. But you it, might pretty soon. Yeah, yeah probably. <laughs> <laughs> and three, uh, 300. I know, I know a lot of, I have a lot of friends mm -hmm. in the Hopton Running Club. Mm -hmm. And, and what, what do you do in the, in the running club in Hopkinton? Yeah, yeah, I run on Saturday runs. It's mm -hmm. a group because it has have other groups. But um, for me, it's perfect Saturday runs. It's a mm -hmm. Saturday yeah. seven thirty in front of the in Main Street, mm -hmm. uh, the group uh, meeting and mm -hmm. go run. Mm -hmm. and, and, and you he, run how many miles? Ah, uh, yeah, I, I start with five k. Okay, mm -hmm. in my first months, mm -hmm. and then now I have three half marathons. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, yeah, three and six months. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, it's not, not. It's a little <laughs> bit crazy, but uh, I have uh, three half marathon. I did my first in October, Ashland mm -hmm. half marathon. I take a, I took a lot of pictures, of course, and that was my first. While you were uh, running, put the Facebook <laughs> for my family. <laughs> yeah, I run. Yeah, uh -huh. it's my first time, and it's amazing. Uh, I, I had, I had three goals with my first half marathon. Mm -hmm. My first, don't walk. It's mm -hmm. my first goal. I said, don't be the last one. All right. Please. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and the last one, uh, run in the minus two hours and 30 minutes. Yeah. And I did the three goals. Okay. Wow. I realized, woo! Congratulations. <laughs> yeah, 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 I'm very proud. <laughs> it's my first, it's my first in my life. Mm -hmm. But for wow. me, it's very important. Mm -hmm. And now I have three, and I have other one in, my, in May in yeah. Providence. Okay. I will run with my dad. My dad wow. will come to Brazil to oh, run with well, me. Best Here's wishes. It. Yeah, thank you. And then will you run here in the Boston Marathon? Well, yeah, not, not this year, mm -hmm. probably, because marathon is very hard. It's a mm -hmm. double thing. Mm -hmm. I, I run yeah. only half marathon, mm -hmm. and I need to train more. Mm -hmm. But it's my it's my dream to next year. Oh, next yeah, year? Next year, probably, wow. yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's very hard because the poor mile for my age, you, age group, you need eight... 45 minutes per mile. Mm -hmm. My pace now is 10. Mm -hmm. And I need to train it hard <laughs> with the group of the running club. Uh -huh. And talking about uh, races and run, yeah. and I have three friends, three, four friends, closer friends mm -hmm. in the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. And we have one, it's totally one day in December last year, I one, one conversation, she talked about, ah, you can run on Tuesday together because you live one near, closer the other one. Ah, good idea. Mm -hmm. uh, first time in my home. I thought, okay. And they come to my home. I have uh, three people run all every week with me. And uh, come on, I have cheese bread rolls uh, in Portuguese, <laughs> Pão de Queijo. All right. Uh, you can come. You run, come to my home. And now you have every Tuesday you do that. Ah. It's a mm -hmm idea of the last year but mm -hmm. now you, you you did this all the time one time it's my home mm -hmm. other time is the other home mm -hmm. and i'm cooking mm 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, because I'm cooking nothing in Brazil. <laughs> so you had to offer something to your running yeah, friends. Yeah, yeah. And that it has inspired you to cook. Because I know previously, yeah. uh, before this interview, you said you had done no cooking, not no, even yeah. boiling an egg. It's evolution. <laughs> <laughs> evolution. Yeah, evolution. <laughs> I'm cooking now. I, I I made something for them like brigadeiro. It's a chocolate chocolate oh. chocolate truffle, Brazilian chocolate truffle. It's a very usual in mean, Paris of children children's party, mm-hmm. and the Michels are like it a lot. But she they like it mm-hmm. a lot the brigadeiro, and I did um, cheese bread rolls too. It's mm-hmm. on the occasion. And other things, the mm-hmm. padão de frango. It's, the name is in Portuguese. It's very hard. <laughs> but uh, I cook it uh, using instructions and directions in English, and yeah. sometimes I use the YouTube yeah. in Portuguese too. I use mm-hmm. Portuguese sometimes, and I wow. use yeah because the, the 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 in Portuguese and a little bit different the things in the, for cooking. The directions right. are a little bit different. Mm-hmm. It's like teaspoon, and tablespoon, and the other. Other things, the pronunciation is totally different. Yeah. <laughs> so that that takes adaptation, which I think is kind of a theme of uh, in knowing you uh, that you uh, just uh, shine about uh, <laughs> and that you uh, do it so well. You uh, bring your uh, light wherever you are yeah. and and zap the creativity of uh, daily life, whether it's cooking or running yeah, or, like, or the arts as well. And I, I just want to also. Um, go over the fact that you have only been speaking English a, a little amount of time, right? Short amount of time? Yeah, I, uh, for me, very hard here is speaking English because only one year, a few months here, I need to talk. About, I have only American friends. I don't have Brazilian friends here. I know there are a lot of Brazilians in Framingham and Milford, but <laughs> I have only American friends. And sometimes they are, they are funny or I am funny, I don't know, because sometimes I'm running mm-hmm. and, I'm, and uh, I'm talking about mm-hmm. a lot of things and mm-hmm. I, when I was running and I'm running and uh, sometimes the, my neighbors look, from, look to me and, <gasps> what she's talking about? <laughs> <laughs> I, I put this name with question mark face. Question mark face. Question mark okay. face. I don't know if What does that look like? It's like, <laughs> what she's talking about? <laughs> Many times when I'm running and one look for the other one and, what she's talking about? <laughs> <laughs> and I laugh a lot, but I, oh, oh my God, I, I repeat the other way. I use my hands, I can't draw. <laughs> you can't understand me. <laughs> so it's only a year and a half you've been speaking English, is that right? Yeah, um, in my home I speak Portuguese. Yes, uh, well, with it's my family. Really yeah, yeah. excellent. Yeah, yeah. 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 That you are also doing things like reading recipes in English while you're yeah, English, yeah. as well as Portuguese. Yeah. <laughs> um, and uh, so that's quite remarkable uh, in coming over here and adapting so quickly. Um, and uh, I know oh, you made a significant change in your life in moving over here for your family, really, leaving your career. Yeah. Uh, so that there would be some changes for uh, the best of your family. Uh, yeah, as it's, well here. yeah, it's the, the for us when you move to here. Yeah. My, my husband works in an American company mm-hmm. and he did one proposal for come here. Mm-hmm. It's, a, it's a good, good thing for our sons. Mm-hmm. And They're college, going to school here. yeah, exactly. Mm-hmm. Uh, the good opportunities for to, to colleges here is best colleges in Boston, it's best mm-hmm. colleges in Brazil, in the world, and we come because them too. Mm-hmm. It's all the culture, all the view about the life, uh, other growing growing up. Mm-hmm. I think it, it, all the family growing up, mm-hmm. and I need to bye bye say bye bye for my things. Mm-hmm. I work a lot. I need to change my life. From Brazil in the time you yeah. left living there, and but this is temporary living here. Yeah, yeah, many some years here. The contact yeah. for to some years, some years, and but I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know I love it here. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know the life, what's the, the ways of the life, the paths of the life, but. And now I can enjoy my life here and enjoy my friends. Enjoy. Ah, by the way, I'm I'm doing uh, art class, oil painting classes in Hopkins Center for the Arts. That's new for you. Totally new. Totally new. Yeah, because uh-huh. it's a new center every day. I can discover <laughs> new centers inside me all the days. Well, uh, I, you just started painting, and I heard that you've had your art exhibited. I think you were in the Hopkins Crier. 
already yeah, for your yeah. art and I asked you if you could show one of your paintings. Yeah, yeah. Okay. The, my first time I paint my colors of autumn mm -hmm. and it's, uh, okay, it's my first time and I ever paint in my life. I, I, I bring here, mm -hmm. can I show you? This is my, ta oh, <laughs> this is my colors of autumn. For yes. me it's like a baby, it's my, my, my son. <laughs> Because my first, oh Gabriel, sorry, <laughs> this is my first painting. Uh, did you so, take lessons with someone at the Central yeah, Arts in Hopton? Yeah, I did lessons in Hopton. I'm, uh, I'm doing, I'm doing. Uh, and then you're taking off on your own. Uh, yeah, and the first time, my first in December last year, it's my first uh, art show, students art ah, show. Yeah, mm -hmm. for me it's a big event. For me, everyone, everything is a big event. Yes. Uh, <laughs> because I, I see the things like a big event in my life. Mm -hmm. And I put my, my painting, my take picture, my friends come, my mm -hmm. neighbors that, that run with me come too. And, and uh, the, the Hopton Crier yeah. is, comes to the interview and interview me. Ah, talking about your painting. Oh my God, in English, oh my God. <laughs> and I talking about my painting, my creative process. This is my first and love. Mm -hmm. It's like me now with you. It's laughing a lot. It's my first painting, but I'm very happy. <laughs> Well, congratulations yeah, thank you. on your um, newborn painting. Okay, yeah. <laughs> and poems. I, I, uh, That's our common like, interest. Uh, yeah. We've been talking about that also. I yeah, mean, talking yeah. about po uh, I, paintings, I, I have other paintings. I did one Colors of Santorini. I okay. have others. Mm -hmm. I did one art show for that too. Uh, I did one... I participated of one art forum in February, I think, this year, yes. and with poems and art, I love it. <laughs> you uh, shared both areas of your art. In yeah, the because I write day. poems mm -hmm. too. I have you were writing yeah, in Brazil, yeah, right? And you had a yeah, book published? My, yeah, yeah, I published this book in uh, 2003 wow. in yeah. Brazil. What is the title? And Poetic Treasury, because in Portuguese, <laughs> it's in Portuguese, Tesouro Poetico in Portuguese. Tesouro? Poetico, yes. It's Poetic Treasury. Mm -hmm. And I did in 2003 uh, poems. Uh, all my life I write. All my life, and since 10 years old I wrote. I, I write. Years old, 10 yeah. years old, yeah. Mm -hmm. All my life. <laughs> and now I'm doing two things: poems and paintings. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's art. I love yes. art. Uh -huh. And uh, I can I can read one. Yes. Uh, in Portuguese here. first. Yes. Please. And um, in English, of course. <laughs> <laughs> uh, passageiro. Na vida somos passageiros. Da vida pega-se um único trem. Chega um momento em que decidimos abrir a cortina e percebemos o grande número de trens que correm paralelos, em universos distintos, de vidas que correm paralelas às nossas. Os trens variam de modelo e tamanho, mas as cortinas permanecem fechadas, como se os passageiros de uma dimensão temessem o cruzamento de atmosferas. Só que é inevitável. Os olhos são faróis deslumbrados com o brilho de novas viagens. E cada ser humano é uma viagem muito particular. Se contarmos os trens, os vagões, os assentos e os homens, estaremos perdidos numa teia de relacionamentos. E é nessa teia, aparentemente confusa, que se encontram as imagens comuns. Pessoas que partilham da mesma viagem interior e que têm como essência comum o pôr do sol, na mesma tonalidade, um passageiro do tempo. Em português, oh, now in English. Beautiful it's language. like song, like music. It is, it is very musical. Uh, in passenger. Mm -hmm. In life you are passengers. In life you take a single train. There comes a time when you decide to open the curtain and realize the large number of trains that run parallel in different universes, other lives that run parallel to ours. Trains vary from model and size, but the curtains remain closed, as the passengers of a dimension fear to cross in atmospheres. It's just inevitable. Mm -hmm. The eyes are dazzle headlights with the lust of new trips, and every human being is a very special trip. If you count the trains, wagons, seats and men, you'll be lost in a web of relationships, and is that web, apparently confused, which are common stock people who share the same inner journey and they have a common essence, the sunset, in the same shade, a passage of time. Wow. And clear. Wow. It's clear. It's clear. It's very clear. <laughs> and it's a beautiful poem and it's a 
inspirational um, of life and our connection with one another. Yeah. And it seems a bit of your anthem uh, to represent who you are and what you believe and being a exactly me. <laughs> exactly you. Yeah, you're perfect. Yeah. To Brazil to here, yeah. and, and you don't know where next, um, but uh, you make the most of where you are at the moment. Um, you uh, leave a career and an identity where you transform uh, a pension company yeah. over in Brazil uh, in ways in getting them excited about running and theater and creativity in different yeah. ways. And um, and then you uh, come over to the United States to Hopkinton and uh, bring a bit of you from Brazil and you, here you are now in the United States who you are to what you're doing around you and uh, contributing to the arts and to poetry <laughs> and, you. and running. You yeah. know, they might hear you down the street laughing uh, when you're training for maybe the marathon. Yeah, you know, yeah. <laughs> taking pictures <laughs> and bearing children paintings. Yeah. <laughs> And uh, it just, uh, it sounds, uh, it's wonderful, um, I think, uh, how you look at life um, and take it on. Yeah. And uh, keep show moving. us all yeah. that. Keep moving. Keep this moving. Is your, the, because the, the change is our best gift. Change yeah. is our best gift. It's our mm -hmm. best gift mm -hmm. um, to me. Now I know that because uh, you, I have the opportunity to know other people, mm -hmm. to know other culture, to know other cinches, <laughs> other <laughs> other me inside me, mm -hmm. and I think it's if the our mission in the in this world is growing up, recover, rediscovery, and grow up to the life because mm -hmm. you have a, a great opportunity to know amazing people, mm -hmm. but your heart is necessary. You open your heart, mm -hmm. you open your gates, you open your mind, because you change when you think about the change all the time because the change is inevitable. <laughs> mm, wow, well that is beautiful. Uh, I would like to write that down and uh, share it with others and carry it with me to remind myself of this. Well, that's really important because we are human and we have a lot of change going on that's yeah. sometimes difficult and sometimes of joy and to embrace it and make the most of yourself you're saying so yeah. thank you i think we uh need to end at this point i'm just wondering if you have any and uh, last message for your friends in brazil for your friends in the united states uh hopkinton yeah <laughs> uh thank you so much for being part of my life this is my best thing Yes. You are my best friends um, in Brazil and here. Yes. Thank well, you so much. Um, thank you so much. Too. It was a pleasure okay, to have pleasure. this interview.